Season 2 of Morph is live. They are live on Mainnet after their Season 1, which was on Testnet. Here we go on Mainnet. We don't need to say much because I've already made a video about Morph. Quick recap, it's one more layer 2 of Ethereum and its target is the consumer, the retail user. A lot of things on their website. If you want to refresh your memory, just scroll here. 20 million is still their funding from March of 2024 it's an okay funding we're waiting to see if they get more in the future all the steps for today's video for more fun minute is these guys and where you can find it on the first link of the description i'm just a guy on the internet and for sure not a financial advisor so please do your own research because crypto are highly speculative and very volatile assets step number one the season two of morph let's go here where we can find all the information the bridges the gas usage our dashboard for this season two before we begin with our interactions here just click on the top left on the morph sign and here go Go and claim your points from season one only seven points for me i didn't interact as much as it needed with testnet i only did one or two transactions per week people on the team that also got this amount some other guys got three and four and some other guys got like 60 and 70 that's a big number and let's go here on the q a section to find out how we can earn these points and here are the four ways on how we can earn points for season two of morph bridging assets to morph mainnet spending gas on morph mainnet obviously by interacting with the dubs on the mainnet inviting new friends to season number two participating in special events like Bicket Wallet event and if you scroll down and you open every number here you can see more details about each one of these criteria. Step number two the Morph main bridge. Is this mandatory? I don't even know you know my opinion we always need to do at least one bridge from the main bridge of course you can go to my link and complete your bridge or you can be here on the dashboard and click on the bridge either from here or from here do the main bridge beware because this is from ethereum main look at the way guys i just did it one hour ago with way at like 10 9 and it cost me 9 usd so beware of ethereum gas fees and complete your bridge I did 0.1 for beginning and we will see. Step number three, the third party bridges. Three for now. This is Renzo, this is Alto and this is Orbiter. Alto and Orbiter are farming us. So prefer Retro because you interacting with Retro Bridge, we're handing its airdrop. So always the destination must be Morph like here. Again, the destination is Morph, destination Morph. The good things about the good thing about third party bridges is that we can start our bridge from from other networks like ZK Sync, like here Zero or like Arbitrum and gas fees are way cheaper. So this is another way to bridge your Ethereum to Morph. Step number four, Bulba Swap Dex. We've seen it also on Morph Mainnet. Right now Antivirus does not let this website open so I disabled it for 10 minutes. It's perfectly safe and obviously here we can swap and we can add liquidity. I just did my first swap before from Ethereum 0.01 to USD this is so make your first swap and obviously you can add liquidity here so add liquidity choose your pair click the amount that you like approve and supply this pair token as you can see i have now added ethereum and usdc in this liquidity pool of bulba swap now hear me out guys did you see how fast morph is how cheap morph is? the transactions went through in like two seconds with very low gas fees we as a drop hunters have this advantage we're interacting with every network and we know when a network is successful you know what i've been talking about if you have used scroll and tyco previously these two networks are doomed are trash they cost like half a dollar for any transaction and the transaction may go through in five minutes that networks are really dead in contrast to morph which is really fast and cheap i really like morph step number five is zoom index exactly like bulbasap more interactions here be on the morph mainnet and do a couple of subs and their liquidity the same things that we do in every decentralized exchange so from time to time use either bulbasap or izumi one week the first and the second week the other one you know how this game is played 
Step 6, the Morph NFT. This is the Morph. Uh, here is the NFT launchpad of Morph. Here you can buy, sell, collections. You know what are we doing in NFT platforms. For example, I will go this for the floor price 0.01. I won't be buying right now. Just to show you the process, you select, you can buy this NFT like this. Click here and verify your buy. Of course, when you have it, you can always list this for sale. This is very new. It's only the second day. So we will have to wait for more nft collections only to verify for now just this interaction will be a great transaction in the future registering a domain is always a great idea for step number seven as you saw i earned twenty thousand dollars from suey name service so yes go ahead and do it it only cost five dollars here search for your domain for example jimbo anything here you see if it's available add to the card yes for now this is mine keep in mind that gns open operates in many networks so you want this dot koala this is for morph so this is the domain of morph go here and complete your purchase i'm just buying this domain as you can see i have domain from Beratin for blast for tyco for scroll to step eight keep an eye on the morph ecosystem because this is literally day two morph mainnet went live yesterday so not all projects are live on mainnet for example do you remember kayak this is one dex like bulba swap this is not live only scroll and avalanche we're waiting for kayak to be live on morph mainnet remember top three this perpetual trading platform that we used to interact on morph testnet again not live on mainnet remember abra finance the borrow lending protocol this is still on testnet so we're waiting for abra again to be on mainnet here is everything on the ecosystem look at this social the games and the consumer a lot of things to do here on morph we're going to deploy a contract on morph for step number nine here we are on nfts to me we are on morph mainnet and we click on additions fill all the required information here project name token symbol project description something very small here and your size of edition upload the photo and deploy your morph mainnet contract guys do you see this fish like six zeros this network is just fantastic Fantastic. Confirm here. Our NFT contract has been deployed. Click here on project dashboard and then we have to go on mint settings. Scroll down here, choose public and drop date and then we're good to go. Left again, go on meeting page, visit page and then once you connect your wallet, mint your first NFT out of 500. And that was it my lovely people. Please hit that like button. It's totally free and it helps a lot if you found this information useful a nice comment is always appreciated guys and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this cheap and fast network not every layer 2 of ethereum is like this so we will keep an eye on this great network at the bottom the official links of morph always click links from here and beware of bad guys that was it for today see you in the next videos here at Todd Shadow Hunters